You're now tuned in to Shoot Your Shot TV. My name is Paul. We're back with another episode for you guys today. But before we get into that, just want to give a quick shout out to our affiliates, Good Rad Ugly and the Game Ball Podcast. Make sure you click the link in the description below. Check out their content. I also want to give a shout out to my bro Jay Otis, who's been killing the artwork for me for all the songs we've been dropping lately. On today's episode, we got the Adidas Yeezy 500. Boom. Also known as the Adidas Yeezy Desert Rats. I don't know why they call them that, but it's a pretty sick name for a shoe. It's Shoot Your Shot Records, it's the Yeezy 500, it's the Desert Rats, it's the Desert Storms. Desert Sound like a DJ Clue like mixtape intro. intro. It's Shoot Your Shot TV. Deal with it. Did you guys deal with it? No. Anyways, the Yeezy 500 is the latest shoe in the Adidas Yeezy line. Pictures first surfaced of Kanye West wearing these shoes back in early 2017. A pre-order for the first colorway, Moon Yellow, was available in December of 2017, but you also had to purchase an additional $500 of Yeezy supply gear to get the shoes. Fast forward to 2018, the Yeezy 500 in the blush colorway was released in limited quantities at select retailers for All-Star Weekend. The shoe was met with a wider release in April of 2018, and that was the pair we were able to cop. Similar to what I mentioned in our Yeezy 700 Wave Runner review, the Yeezy 500 also takes DNA and aesthetic from vintage 90s Adidas models, specifically the feet you wear line, like the Kobe Crazy 8, the Adidas Salvation, and the K8 II. Similar to the Wave Runners, the Mud Rats were met with mixed reviews. A lot of people put them on their drop list instead of their cop list. Personally, I thought the color was fire from jump, and I didn't have to jump through any hoops to get these. Even though the shoe wasn't super hyped up, it still sold out immediately, as all Yeezys tend to do. Now let's check out the shoes. So here they are, the Yeezy 500 in that blush colorway. It's more so like a tan, and it has this mesh upper mixed with new buck and suede paneling throughout the shoe. It's really cool how they did the pattern on these. The shapes on them are crazy. It's all one solid color, that blush colorway. And right here you can see the suede on the toe box. You have the suede paneling where you would put the laces through. You have the new buck leather through the, throughout the side panels and you have 3M piping that goes along it as well. And the thing about this mesh is that it doesn't go all the way through, so I don't know how the breathability is gonna be, but it's not too heavy. It looks like it would be a heavy shoe, but it's pretty light. Also, it has that Addy Preen technology, no boost. The insole is a Ortholite insole, which I heard is pretty comfortable. Never owned a pair myself until now, but take a look at the shoe. Pretty simple. Another great dad shoe in the books. Let's try them on. trying these on I must say I love them they're super comfortable they're not heavy at all and I want to say that they're not as comfortable as boost because it doesn't have that bounciness or that responsiveness that boost has but they're definitely more comfortable than alpha bounce and they're more comfortable than the alpha edge when you mix this ortholite insole with the adiprene outsole it's a perfect combination I thought it was gonna feel a little bit stiff a little bit heavy but this right here is like Tempur-Pedic for your feet it's really nice and soft and they just pair really well together. And as far as sizing goes, I went with a nine and a half, which is my true size, and it fits perfectly. There's a little bit more room in here than there is in the Wave Runner, so yeah, I would say go true to size. I really like this colorway. I'm gonna keep this shoe, I'm not gonna resell it. And if you have a chance to pick these up, you definitely should because the price is only gonna go up. It's only gonna appreciate as all Yeezys tend to do. So if you still have a chance to get these at a good price, you should do it now. But yeah, man, I love the new Yeezys, man. Yeezys back. 
He got the Easy 500. He got the Kid Cudi album coming soon. He got the Pusha T album coming soon. He got the album with Nas coming soon. I like the new Kanye. That's our show for today. Shoot Your Shot TV, Shoot Your Shot Records. If you like these videos, again, please subscribe. Please comment. Hit that like button. Shoot Your Shot TV. We out. Hello?